What is going on, guys? This is Brandon from Brixton. So, uh, we haven't done this in a while, but uh, here it is. So, I am getting ready for an auction. So, I haven't done an auction in a long time. I did a lot last summer, last fall, uh, into the winter a little bit. And then I, I just needed to take a break during the holidays. I tried to get back into it uh, this spring and it just wasn't working out so i had to take a step back um so that being said today is june 2nd i'm gonna have this video come out this afternoon uh so that my normal 8 a.m video doesn't like stack on top of it uh but that being said i wanted to give you kind of a rundown of what we've got in the auction and i really hope that you join us I am going to put a uh, a link in the description so that you can find me, and I'd love you to follow me there. Uh, certainly, if you haven't subscribed to the YouTube channel, uh, do that because this is not a one-off. This is this is going to be happening again and again. Uh, maybe not as often as some guys do it, but. Uh, nevertheless, I get too much. I need to get rid of some stuff. So uh, let me just show you what I've got because I'm, I'm kind of excited about some of this stuff. All right. So first things first, we have a ton of, excuse me, 80 and 90s era uh, space guys, castle guys, uh, pirates. Uh, we also have, so I'll do a little bit closer look at those and then i have uh the blue ones too i have four of the blue ones three are in great condition ones in decent condition but not not flawless but I mean, as you can see the the space symbol which is typically why these don't go very high uh let's see there's six of these five out of six of them are in near flawless condition the red guys is pretty good the black guys here, good. So, yeah, these overall, they're in really, really good shape. So, and if you're not into that here, let me just... Look how those just swiped off the table. This is all the Star Wars minifigs that I have. So, I have a bunch of Star Wars minifigs to go through. Uh, they've all been labeled. Uh, some of these are highly collectible. Some are not uh there's one so i can't remember how to say this guy's name uh he's missing his head but still you're getting the body the the cap or his hair or tentacles or however you want to phrase it um but yeah there's there's some good stuff here's phasma uh phasma typically goes for 20 to 35 dollars uh, i've sold her for i think 35 before so um, there's some decent ones there. I'm not going to go through all of these in the description. Uh, you will be able to, uh, see exactly what I'm selling. So, uh, down here, uh, all right, that happened a lot faster than I thought it was going to. Sorry. Okay, so then I've got these. So, uh, here are some Lord of the Rings sets. Uh, specifically, I believe both these are from The Hobbit. Uh, and the Black Monarch, Monarch's Castle from the 80s. I can't remember what this one's name is, but this one's from 80s era space stuff. Now I'll flip you around and we'll do some walk-ins. So, gotta go into my, my other closet. <clears throat> so, here we go. It's gonna get dark because the lights aren't even on in the building yet. Bear with me. All right. Bright light, bright light. All right, guys. So uh, let me let me flip this around. I'm gonna show you the one treasure I found the other day, and as far as I can tell, this is complete. So I have a daily bugle to sell. Um, all the guys are in here. So they're all in that bag right there, and they are all there. I verified all the guys the other day. They're there. So uh, that's a good find. Here's a bunch of sets right here. These all will have the minifigs in here. 
Uh, the Kessel Run Falcon. Oh my goodness, I forgot I had the Kessel Run Falcon. Oh, it's been a busy last couple months. So, there we go. There's some Atlantis stuff, some space stuff. Uh, 6895, you'll have to look that one up. Here's the Black Thunder. I'm telling you guys, I have so much. Like, all of these bins right here are full of sets. Not all for sale, but... Uh, then we have... This gem from the 80s. This set even comes with part of the box. So... I'm telling you, you guys need to check it out. I'm going to get out of that room. We're going to go back to the other room. So, I, like I said, I have a lot of good stuff coming, guys. I really encourage you to jump on the WhatNot auction, uh, play some bids. Uh, usually I do some giveaways, depending on how the night's going. So, yeah, come hang out. Get to interact with me a little bit more one-on-one. -on -one, and I look forward to it. So, I can't believe I forgot I had a Kessel Run Falcon. <laughs> I have too many Lego. What can I say? Anyways, my Lego will become your Lego next week. On the 7th at 5 p.m. Mountain Standard Time. The link will be in the description down below. So, Join me on there next Tuesday and we will see you next time, my friends.